Hi and welcome back to An Englishman in the Balkans here on IGTV and in a recent vlog because I've started using this and its vertical video format I asked a question I said go on ask me anything because I had never used that Instagram sort of tool um, that they have and Ilaria who is from Italy and I believe is based in Teslich but anyway, she's in Bosnia-Herzegovina, <coughs> learning the language and everything, uh, and having a, a blast and, you know, having a great time. Says, hi David, what do you like the most about living in the Balkans? It's a very difficult one to answer. Very, very difficult. And why? Well, I've been here for a few years now, just over, I don't know, 18, maybe 20. But I think I should do a number of these videos about what it's like for me or what I enjoy most about living in the Balkans because I can't do it all in one and I want to keep this just under three minutes so <clears throat> here we go. I actually like the difference in the culture of living somewhere which is completely different from what I ever knew before. So little things, not big things, but little things such as how people cook their food, how people serve their food, all the little nuances about eating meals in what sequence things happen. You don't have to have an empty plate to show that you're finished because showing an empty plate just obviously means that the host is gonna give you more. And I've suffered on more than one occasion with that. I also like very much how nothing is wasted. I think my Britishness or the British culture I left behind was a very much a throwaway culture. So if you had a, you know some food or whatever and you wanted to make a particular meal with it, and I'm talking about food today, I know, then when it got old in the fridge, you just throw it away. But it seems that here in this region that people can can always repurpose things and they use everything that they have so for example still on food if there's a pig or an animal being slaughtered for winter food and, and it could be a lamb or whatever nothing will go to waste they'll use every single part of that animal I think back home in the UK we would just go for certain cuts and then we would just disregard the rest so the food aspect I find very 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 interesting and the other thing my two things that I'm going to talk about that are enjoyable for me for living in the Balkans is is being exposed to family and to friendship where people are much more intense with their relationships than they are back in the UK so for me people will stick by you family will stick with each other they'll stop planned activities if they if it's needed to be around to help somebody if somebody's got stuck with some money and they lost their job for example and there's precious little in the way of social security here then everybody will throw some money in so to speak to keep that person going to make their life as best as it possibly can so I think it's a much more relationship intensive environment and I like that very much I could say a lot more Ilaria but I've just got to like plan it a bit more and I just thought ah I haven't done this because you posted this a few days ago so I thought I'd dive in now I'm still on Chiovo this island in the Adriatic opposite split and right next to Trogir so I've still got a few days to do some more so I hope that answers a part of the question that you put to me and for anybody else that's watching please follow uh, Ilaria's example and just send me a message on Instagram or wherever else you see this and I'll try and answer as best I can and I'm doing this at the golden hour um, I'll tell you what time it is now it's half past eight in the evening and we're going to get another spectacular sunset so that's it IGTV it is a bit raw but I did say when we put these things together now for IGTV it's going to be raw it's not going to have all the wonderful production values that might go into something such as YouTube please let me know what you think about the vertical video concept I will be sharing this on Facebook so you'll see it there and I will most probably post this as well on to YouTube so please let me know and comments as I say always well appreciated please follow here on IGTV and I will catch you very very soon just one more thing would you like to shout goodbye Tam Bye, people, have a nice time. did you get that I, did it, I hope you bye did you. bye for now